Hey guys, have you ever wondered how to measure seats in your car? Well, today we're gonna walk you through that process. So once you've decided which seats you're interested in, navigate to our website and find the product page where you'll see a line art diagram with all of the dimensions of each seat listed. Now that you've decided which seats you're interested in, we'll get into measuring. For this step, you're gonna need a tape measure and a notepad and pen or your phone to jot down those measurements. We'll start off with the width. Measure the distance between the widest points, taking into account any potential obstacles such as center consoles or door cards. In this case, we're gonna have about 21 inches of clearance. Next up is height. We're gonna measure the vertical space from where the seat meets the slider up until the highest point it can go before it hits the roof. In this case, we have about 40 inches of clearance. When we measure the stock seats, they're 36 inches tall and our replacement trail cat seats are 38 inches tall. So knowing that we have the 40 inches of clearance means that we're okay to go ahead and install the trail cat seats being that they're 38 inches tall. Next up is the depth. We're gonna measure from the furthest point back that the seat may reach all the way up to the furthest point forward that the seat may reach. In this case, we have about 28 inches of clearance, which is gonna be plenty of space for our trail cat seats. This may not be the same for your particular vehicle, especially if you have an aftermarket roll cage or any type of harness bar setup. That's gonna be something that you wanna keep in mind while you're measuring your depth. And that's how to measure your vehicle's interior space to ensure that your Corbo seats are gonna fit. Please feel free to give us a call or shoot us an email if you have any questions.